I work for two Labour Secretaries of State working on energy and climate change and currently I work for the Shadow Minister and I get to advise him on the climate, what things are changing, what we believe our policies should be. Um, for instance, we've changed our position recently on fracking and said that we're going to have a 100% ban. Um, I also got to be, have the absolute privilege of being able to work uh, on the Labour Manifesto and got to write a large section of the, the energy climate change part of the Manifesto which was absolutely wonderful. I think one of the most important bits of advice is actually one that my father told me, which is, until you know what you want to do, do what you love. Before I really figured out that climate change was the thing that, that I really wanted to focus on, I knew that I really enjoyed geography. I love the great outdoors, I love the mountains, I love being in the sea. And the opportunity to kind of understand that and explore it really excited me. And so that's a big part of the reason why I studied geography at Swansea. When I finished at Swansea, which I thought was a fantastic place to kind of get me started on, on the journey that's, that's taken me on the rest of my life, I ended up getting a big motorbike and driving from the UK out to the furthest reaches of Southeast Asia on a big two-year trip, um, which was absolutely amazing. And on that trip, I got to really use my geography course to understand the, the landscape around me. And I met so many lovely, lovely people. And when I came home from that, I felt that I really wanted to try and give something back to these amazing people who had all been so lovely to me. And uh, having the understanding of all these complex systems and how they are being pulled out of kilter made me really want to get into climate change. So I moved to London. I didn't know many people here and I, I ended up working for a think tank and my geography degree helped me land that job. And I campaigned on fuel poverty and energy efficiency for a few years. And then, not too long after that, I ended up working in Parliament, working for the Labour Minister for Energy and Climate Change. 